State lawmakers may soon decide the fate of teacher pay raise efforts in the 2022 session. 12 News Tal Tal spoke with education officials ahead of a new legislative deadline tomorrow. Ahead of Tuesday's legislative deadline, several big bills on the chopping block are teacher pay proposals from both the House and Senate. We need to keep the pressure on both chambers. Education officials say the severe teacher shortage in Mississippi inspired the bills, where the turnover rate in the Southeast is around 8 to 10 percent. We know that their salaries are so low they cannot pay their bills on the, the salaries that they make. They are, we are absolutely in desperate need of a real pay raise to stop this terrible teacher shortage that we have. Both chambers have said teacher pay is a priority. Education advocates in the Magnolia State worried that the income tax cut debates have in some ways held hostage pay for teachers. We are really expecting that our legislators would do the right thing. The House and Senate proposals are looking to raise close to at least $4,000 on average, depending on the level of certification and years of experience. The shortage of fully prepared teachers um, you know, is, is of concern. Teacher pay has remained a constant topic of debate year after year in the legislature. Other important factors to retain teachers include health benefits, preparation for the job, and advancements within the profession. Today, where does Mississippi stand in the southeastern average? That's a great question. Um, Mississippi actually um, ranks the bottom of the southeastern average and, and also is at the bottom nationally for teacher pay. Um, the southern region is 16% um, below the national average. And in Mississippi, the average teacher pay for 2019-20 um, was $46,843, which is $17,000 less than the typical teacher, um, the, the average teacher in the United States made. Made that same year. Tomorrow is the deadline for committees to report general bills and constitutional amendments originating in the other house. Reporting in Jackson, Tao Ta 12 News.